all right welcome back to another video if you're new here consider cons subscribing if not welcome back it's gonna be a review on the Toro power clear 518 ZE it's an 18 inch width 99 cc and it's the new one it has the overhead valve so it's a four cycle engine and it also has electric start, which I've never used yet. No need for it. It starts right up. I bought this because it's uh, you don't have to mix any gas. You know, it's it's the four cycle engine, so it usually starts right up. And it has a rubber paddle. I like the rubber paddle. So what I use this one for is all my decks and porches I have to shovel off. Instead of shoveling it over a four foot railing, I just lift this up there and it makes pretty fast work of it. And it doesn't eat up the wood deck because it has a rubber paddle. And most of the decks have that composite wood on there and it doesn't... Uh, doesn't leave any black marks or anything like that on those either so this one's pretty basic you squeeze this handle and you can adjust the angle of the chute here's the handle for turning it uh, it is a little bit heavy I left here and on the back handle and I only have to s take it up like five steps So yeah, here's a review on this one. When you get it, you have to put oil in it. It doesn't come all the way full. And to put the oil in it, you actually have to tip the snowblower up on end to get the oil in there, let it sit for a few minutes, and then check it. And when you check it, you just screw the oil plug in. No, that's wrong. So when you check it, you just set the oil plug in and then pull it out and then screw it in to leave it in. Otherwise, if you screw it in to check it, you're going to have too much oil. But really, you might not have enough oil. So when you check it, just stick it on there, pull it out and check it. So the only negative thing I have to say about this one Right here is a key, it's a plastic key. You have to pull it all the way out to get it to shut off. So I would have rather have a kill button or something to push down. And when I first got it, I was always ready to grab it and throw it off the deck because it smelled like it was gonna start on fire. I don't know if the belt inside there is too tight from the manufacturer or just needed to wear in a little bit because now it doesn't do that anymore so I'm pretty confident it's not going to start on fire but yeah when I first got it, it it didn't smell good at all you could definitely smell something burning in there I didn't know if it was the rubber paddle or the belt drive if it is belt drive I assume so um, so yeah, this is a 18 inch cut width by, I don't know, maybe 12 inches or 10 inches tall. I push it through a lot of snow and it shoots it pretty far. And if you're only using it for porches and decks, it's a pretty good investment. I think it was $600, maybe, something like that. I bought it from Home Depot a couple months ago, so it's fairly new still to me. <clears throat> you can unscrew these handles and flip the dust down if you have to put it in your trunk. I put it in a trailer, so I never do that. It's pretty easy to maneuver. It's just on plastic wheels. And... If you lift up on it a little bit when you're using it, 
that rubber paddle acts as self-propelled and it'll pull you across so you don't really have to push it all you have to do is just lift up on it a little bit so yeah thanks for watching if you like hit subscribe it helps me out and i'm not sponsored by toro but i feel i sponsor toro so here's this one here's the big one there's my other one there's my toro my ride 54 inch zero turn and i have a toro all-wheel drive personal pace lawnmower back there and i have a toro i forget what it's called it's a 44 inch commercial grade walk behind pro line pro line outside so i have a few toros <laughs> All right, I'm going to do another review. This is my three-month review on this little guy. I just did a three-year review on that one. That's my everyday one over there. And I got this one last, last season, so I've only used it for maybe three or four months. It's an absolute tank. So, yeah, thanks for watching. Hit that subscribe. And we'll see you on the next one.